Welcome back to the Raspy Voice Kids podcast videos on YouTube. This is Brandon Phoenix, a.k.a. I Also Hate Pit. I'm joined by... Jay and Phoenix in the b- 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 building. Let's He's go, in the baby. building. We ready to go. We ready to rock. It's time to rock. Let me tell you something real quick. I'm glad to be back. We haven't done a video in a long time, and I'm glad that we're finally going to do a Why We Hate. This time we're doing Why We Hate Eastern Kentucky, and it's good to be playing football but I'm mad that we're playing you. Seven and five in the FCS. Seven and five in the Ohio Valley Conference. You guys are pathetic. It's embarrassing. It's ridiculous. It's weak. You really need to be ashamed of yourselves. I don't even know why you guys consider yourself a football school, but you do. You need to reassess. In fact, the only thing, well, I should say, n- the thing that is not not only pathetic about you is not the fact that you stink. It's not just that, okay? Because that's bad enough. But it's the fact that you guys also have a, a Confederate flag mascot, basically. The EKU Colonel, Jeremy, have you seen it? No, I, that's the thing. I haven't even seen it. The EKU Colonel is basically a mascot for the Confederate flag. It's pathetic. It looks so terrible, so tacky, so out of touch. But what are we going to do? We're Mountaineers. We're used to having the best mascot in the world, right? Amen. Speaking of colonels, you couldn't have picked the highest rank in the military? Like, you couldn't have gone with a general? Why would you go with a colonel when you could be a general? Why would you go with a step below when you could be a step above? Maybe it has something to do with your 40% graduation rate. Okay? You guys run people out of school like we're going to run you out of the stadium. It's, It's just ridiculous what we're going to do to you. Not only are we doing better than you academically, but we're going to thr- run it better than you. We're going to throw it better than you. We're going to play it better than you one way or the other. All the way around, y'all about to get housed. It's about to be Mountaineer time. EKU, you have no idea what's about to hit you. The other thing is, Jerry, did you know Eastern Kentucky's not even really in Eastern Kentucky? Oh, you're lying. It's no like, way. It's like 30 minutes south of Lexington. No way. Yes. Yes, Jeremy, this is why we hate Eastern Kentucky University, because we have to play you guys. In fact, we have to pay to play you guys. $450,000 down the drain. At least we get a game. All I'm going to say is this. Be happy you get to play your games in the fall. The rest of your conference is going to wait till the spring. I applaud y'all for that, but that's it. It's about to get real. Jeremy, hit him with the facts. 2020, what a terrible year, and you were pumped. You were pumped. To play football. You were pumped about college football. You thought COVID-19 was bad. Yeah. You thought 2020 was bad. Yeah. Wait till you're sitting in your depressed houses after we mop the floor with you, Eastern Kentucky. You ain't a big boy program. You were a little program. Little programs, you ain't deep. You're dumb. You're like gangster. You're gum. And we chew little programs, hop to spew little programs, we can only view little programs. Like, like little you know, programs. Muted you little programs, thought you was in our class. It's time for you little programs to feel our wrath. That's right. You're going to feel it. We're going to bring it to you. You know why? Because you're a little program. And the day we lose to you is no day. Sean Carter, that's what he said. Trouble. That's his song, Trouble. I'm quoting it. And that's what y'all are in. Trouble. Yeah. We're not, we're not Presbyterian State. Actually, I don't even think they're state. Presbyterian College. We're not Indiana State. <laughs> no, no, Larry Bird. We're not Indiana State. Yeah, shout this to Larry big Bird. Boy football. Think about last year when you played a big boy. Louisville, you lost 42 to nothing. That's what's coming. A whipping because you were a little program. And we got to teach y'all that we don't play around with little programs. Nope. W's. That's all we get. You're going to feel us. You're going to feel our All-Americans. You're going to feel our defense. You're going to feel our offense. So come to Morgantown, baby, and we're going to show you what's up. But th- that's one thing. If you were to lose the big boy programs like that, you've been getting whipped by Western Kentucky, your biggest rival. Now, I've heard of Western Kentucky. I've never in my life heard of Eastern Kentucky University. Western Kentucky has beat you. I think they have a streak uh, uh, somewhere along the series of 13 straight games they beat you. 13 straight! One game they beat you 50 to nothing. 50 to nothing? Three. Worst of all is neither one of you guys a big boy. And yet you have the nerve, the audacity to call the game between you and them the Battle of Bluegrass. Brandon, tell me that's not hilarious. Hilarious. Check, there's two teams called Louisville and Kentucky in that state who own Bluegrass. So how in the world do you have the nerve to call your game the Battle of the Bluegrass? That's like Marshall, Marshall and the University of Charleston calling their game if they play the Battle of Country Roads. Stop it. 
Stop it. Every single thing you do is second tier. Whose logo do you have on your jerseys? Adidas. Second place. Second second tier. It's garbage. Unless you got a check on your jersey, unless you got a Nike sign or a Jumpman jar- jersey, you're garbage. Under Armour. Garbage. Adidas. Garbage. Your program. Garbage. garbage. We rock, we write, we rock the checks. We rock the checks all day, Nike all day. And when you come up here, when you come to Morgantown, listen to Drake when he said it very clear: checks over stripes. Get at us. We're here. Can't wait to see you. RVK all day, baby. West Virginia all day, baby. This ain't gravy. Ain't nothing sweet. You about to find out what's real. West Virginia, baby. That's what's real.